Hello to everyone. This is Murga Ganesh, Assistant Professor, Department of Management Studies, K.S. Rangasamy College of Technology. Today we are going to discuss about the topic, Importance and Levels of Strategy in the subject of Strategic Management. So let us discuss about the meaning of strategy first. So the meaning of strategy is, it's a long-term plan or activities for balancing its internal strength and weakness with its external opportunities and threats to maintain competitive advantage. So the maintaining competitive advantage is a very important for every business unit or in the corp for the corporations so that the business is using the, its internal strength and weaknesses to match its external opportunities and threats to maintain the competitive advantage. And another meaning is a detailed plan for success in situations such as business, industry, war, politics or sport or the skill of planning for such situations. So, the, it is the detailed plan. Strategy means it is the detailed plan, plan for achieving success in various situations like industry, war, politics, sport or whatever it may be. So, this is called strategy. So, let us discuss the importance of strategy. The first one is provide direction and action plan. So, a strategy provides an organization with the right direction which need to be followed for attaining the targets or goals or objectives or whatever it may be. So, it gives clear cut and detailed plan of action for reaching the desired position in the future. So, the strategy which, which gives the, the way to be achieved a particular, uh, particular objective or the way to be achieved a particular goals or targets or whatever it may be. So, it is the clear cut and detailed plan of action for reaching the decide position in the future. So, next important is, importance of strategy is identify trends and opportunities. Means, it identifies various market trends and opportunities. So, before framing a strategy, a strategist or a manager should identify various, various market trends, what is happening, what is going on in the market and future opportunities available to your business. Everything has to be properly analyzed and so that the manager can frame the strategy after analyzing all those things. The strategy examines the variations in the market such as social, political and technological changes as well as the customer changes. So, this everything is changing periodically even if it is a political or technological or changes in the customer preference or whatever it may be, it is the possibility, it is the, it is very obvious that the changes is permanent in the every organization. Once the market changes are identified, it develops develops tactics accordingly so that the business can adjust itself to the future changes. So, changes is permanent. So, the business only wants to change itself to adapt its operation to the changes. So, it is a manager or a, in, a, in different levels framing the strategy according to the changes. So, that is very important. Another importance of strategy is define accountability. So, every employees or stakeholder having their own accountability. So, strategy clearly defines the line of accountability within the business enterprises. It also set the timeline for attaining the desired result with the proper accountabilities. Next one is improve communication and commitment. It enhances the overall level of communication and commitment within the organization by clearly uh, clarify the vision and accountabilities. So, communication, overall level of communication and commitment within the organization is very important. So, that is clari uh, clarifying through the vision and accountability. Next one is allocation of resources. So, uh, allocation of right resources is very important. Right allocation of resources is must for every organization, be it a large or a small organization. This way, it ensures that the resources are deployed properly efficiently, effectively providing maximum output for the organization. So, allocation of resources is the another one importance of strategy. Next one is providing framework for decision making. Means, the strategy provides a well-defined framework for decision making to business enterprises. So, it gives reference point for decision as each of them need to support the strategy. So, next one is competitive advantage. Com companies are able to achieve competitive advantage over the competitor by forming strategy. So, without strategy, competitive advantage, gaining the competitive advantage is impossible. This way, resources are utilized efficiently and everything goes in the right way, thereby providing maximum output to the 
business so the competitive advantage is very very important and essential for every organization so once it is identified the strategy has to be framed to attain the competitive advantage of the business so uh, next let us discuss on the topics levels of strategy so the first one is corporate level strategy the corporate level strategies are one which which are decided by senior management at the top level of a diversified company so corporation is nothing but it is consist of different business units so a corporation is controlling the different business unit so this business unit may produce so many product and so produce so many services to the customer so and the corporate is controlling and framing the strategy as a whole a diversified company refers to a group of companies that are are operated under its umbrella like png tractor and cable Apple, INC, Partex, BPC are the some example of the corporations. The corporate level strategy defines the long term objective of the company and influences all business units working under it. So, corporate level strategy which are framed by the top management in corporate level. So, this strategy is nothing but long term objective of the company and influences all business units under these co corporations working under it it tells the overall direction of the company with regards to its various business and product lines business level strategy these strategies are framed at business unit level by senior managers of the unit it defines the basis on which a firm will com uh, compete with others so business level strategy is a business unit level so management senior level management will define or decide uh, or frame such kind of strategy to compete with others business strategies aims at building a good competitive position of the company for its product and services it includes competitive and cooperative strategies business strategies encompasses all approaches and tactics to compete with the competitors how to differentiate business and its product with others in a manner in which new market will be acquired so next one is functional level strategy so functional level strategy means strategies of various departments or division within the business enterprises it is also called a departmental level strategy and as every function of a business is vested with its department this strategy focuses on particular functional area of the company such as hr production marketing finance and sales so functional level strategy is formulated in order to attain specific goals of uh, business units via efficient utilization of the resources so the efficient utilization of the resources is most important so these resources are mainly utilized in the functional level and so that the functional level managers are deciding how these resources can be effectively utilized to achieve the uh, functional level objectives so next one is operational level strategy operational level strategy is formed at operating units of the company by operating managers so these strategies deal with the translation of business strategies into actionable implementation process so this is in this is very uh, very important in the in a business unit that these operational level strategies are framed by the operating managers these strategies with assistance from mid level managers for attaining immediate objective of the particular assignments so thank you for listening thank you so much